no God saying what the truth is. So you have to compete with my truth. My truth is you suck. You're just a selfish little consuming monster that is, is injected into the world and set loose on it. You know, unless you grow a brain, you're, you're, you're capable of lots of damage, causing lots of harm with your desire to acquire. That's the definition of our reality. That's the definition of the force of evolution, is to make machines that consume and reproduce and cannibalize. And they're going to do it through a desire to acquire, an addiction force. Yet, yeah, that's the force. Addiction. A pointless and senseless need to have. Not because it needs to be had, but because you can't be comfortable unless you have it. And the simple solution is to say, don't create the problem. But atheists don't like that solution. They don't like that as the answer. That's the conclusion from evolution, is that it's just a big waste engine, that you're not accomplishing anything, that you're all just a bunch of maggots swimming in a bunch of diseased and, and rotting corpsey flesh that you call your earth. Get real, life is stupid as stupid can be. You're just addicted little stinking dirty maggots. The whole game is crap because it was built by a crap engine. Life is just, it's, it's consumption, reproduction, for no good reason, for the sake of reproduction. Cannibalism, which means on island planet, that's right, it eats its own ancestors, it eats its own parents, it eats its own kind, it eats things of its own value and uh, addiction. It's motivated by a feeling mechanism that creates intense motivation for it to, to keep digging in the humus. But the game is, is that as atheists, you are conceding there is a, a rational reality to be discerned. And the rational reality is that you don't have to be a fucking bug. It might be a bug planet, but you don't have to be a bug. You don't have to think like a bug. You don't have to feel like a bug. So yeah, control your lizard, control your ape, be an intellectual, and recognize in some sort of solemn humility that being atheist comes with the burden of understanding. It comes with the burden of a higher moral doctrine than the babble of the Bible. Yeah, you're obligated to give a shit about what it all adds up to. And what it all adds up to is a stupid game played for no purpose that just eats pieces. It just eats pawns and bishops and kings and queens. It just eats them and eats them and eats them. And the game keeps getting played because no one says stop. Partly because the religious nuts won't let anybody say it, but I certainly don't see the non-religious doing anything to say this is part of being an atheist. Part of being an atheist is just recognizing there's no rational good story here. It's all a bad story. It's all just a fucking mess.